Welcome to Quick Fix, the show where I answer your most commonly asked tech questions. Today, we're gonna trick out your iPhone home screen. The long-awaited iOS 14 upgrade is finally here, and that means iPhone users can now customize their home screens. Here's how you do it. First, decide what look you want for your iPhone. An Animal Crossing theme, perhaps? Hell, you could even go full old-school Windows. Next, find some iPhone icons by Googling around. You can check out a site like icons8.com for some ideas. Download those icons to your iPhone camera roll. Then install a third-party app called Widgetsmith, which lets you customize your iPhone's fonts and colors. Then download Shortcuts, an Apple app. You'll need that to change your iPhone's icons. And unfortunately, you can't actually change them manually. Instead, you'll have to create shortcuts from the new icons you've downloaded to the apps you want to link them to. Yeah, it's a little bit complicated. Within the Shortcuts app, hit the plus sign in the top right corner. Then tap Add Action and select Scripting. From there, choose the Open App command. At this point, pick the app you want to open. Once this is done, hit the three dots and select Add to Home Screen. From here, write the name of the app and then hit the icon picture to the left. Select the Choose Photo option to open up your camera roll and select that icon that you chose for this particular app in step one. Repeat that process for every app you want a custom icon for. Then long press your home screen to send all of the old app icons you don't want to the app library where you don't have to look at them ever again. Using shortcuts to choose custom icons for your home screen will slow down your app loading times. But if you're committed to a certain aesthetic, you might not care about the performance trade-off.